These poor winemakers, they don't have any control over what you put their beautiful I wines in. You. In music, if you could have the greatest music, but if you have a bad speaker, exactly. it's terrible. So we uh. create tools that are loudspeakers for wine that speak to all of your senses. Ready for sound? Yeah. Okay, so when we toast, it's belly to belly. Whoa. Now put it to your ear. That's Isn't cool. that crazy? One okay. more time, one okay. more time. Absolutely. Typically, the wines, if they're a little bit more dense and a little bit more, a little higher in alcohol, um, they tend to have a little slower stream of legs. That's what it means. The slower Versus, stream means more alcohol. Yes, generally speaking, and viscosity in the wine. Wine is serious. This is it deep. It is serious. But this it's is so not. Fun. This is deep. Oh my it's god. It's so fun. And when you mix the glassware in, like it takes it to a whole new level. We have these amazing pieces in front of us here. These decanters. Yes. And they're all hand blown. They look like animals, like this could be a snake, a duck, or... Exactly. And our owner, 11th generation Maximilian Riedel, he is responsible for these designs. This was one of his very first designs. So he poured into the decanter. It's cool, right? Following this nice, long look at journey that. down the neck of the decanter. It's beautiful to look at, right? How much do these be costing like this? How, how much this cost? So right? this is also handmade. If it's handmade, if it has gold on it, it's about to be a, a pretty nice ticket. So, Dollar signs, yes. So this is about $500. OK. It comes with a DVD that shows you how to use the decanter as well. Because what would happen if you tried to use the decanter, pour your friend or your father a glass of wine, and nothing comes out? So oh, you got originally, they thought maybe a design flaw. No, it's genius. By turning the decanter, you charge the wine, do you hear that? You charge the wine, you push pure oxygen into the wine, and then load the second chamber. So there's two chambers in this decanter. <laughs> You're then preloading a pour crazy. of a few ounces, which is a perfect pour. That's what, load in there, a perfect pour? Yep. That's cool. Do you want to try it? Hell yeah. OK. I got to full load it. You gotta full load it. Beautiful. That's it. I so it's love easy. This. It's easy. So, okay. What is decanting? What is? I mean, what is that? So it's actually gonna soften the tannins in wine. Okay. So it's gonna make it a little bit softer, a little bit more pleasant. Um, it also kind of releases that caged up CO2 that's been hanging out in the bottle. Ten four. This is Mamba, and Mamba also has two chambers. You put the wine into the decanter, obviously here, and then you push the wine into the back part of the decanter, and then you drop it. Kind of like it's hot. Go and all right. Last but not least, how much Absolutely. is this big sucker right here? That is a two thousand dollar decanter. That's two thousand dollars. Two thousand dollars. This is like the bomb diggity decanter. This is for the big parties. You're bringing out the big three liter bottles of wine. Other way? Exactly. Yep. It's very. You're, you look very good with this decanter. This one you can play. You can blow it. You can, yeah, you can blow. You can blow this? Yeah. It comes with a DVD. Yeah, a little bit more pursed. Maybe there needs they to be. They're going to make it make noise. Yeah, of course. Of on the course. TV, they're going to make it sound and good. And it can be played me. with or without wine in it, which is really cool. It's kind of a fun feature. So when it's had wine in it, it has a little different tone. 